Hello everyone. It's me, Infinite Designer. This is the part 15 of our series where I will teach you the entire Alight Motion app from zero to infinity. So, let's begin. Today, we are going to learn about move and transform. So this is the shape that I have today. The first effect is auto shake. Here your object will shake like this. You can adjust the intensity of shake by magnitude. You can adjust the speed of shake by frequency. Adjust the angle of shape also. If you set the slack to 100, then the object will shake in every direction like this. You can adjust the Z shake also if you want the object to shake forward and backward also. For next effect, I have this path layer here under the shape layer, which is created by vector drawing. The name of the effect is move along path. Now the shape will move onto the path as you increase the progress value. Now I suggest you to disable the rotate automatically option as of now. You can adjust the orientation of the object also. Next effect is Offset. Here you can make this type of shape copy effect. Another effect is called Oscillate. Here you can create this type of moving animation. You can adjust the options like angle of movement 
magnitude and frequency of movement. You can animate the object in depth by setting the direction to depth. You can make a orbit rotation animation also like this. Next effect is pulse size. Here your object will animate like a pulse. You can set the value of how much the shape should shrink and grow. Next effect is called random displacement. Here your object will be animated in random directions like this. Here you have to animate your object by adding keyframes in evolution options. Next effect is random jitter. Here you can make an animation in which your object will be jittered randomly like this. Next effect is called raster transform. This effect is only for transform the object in every aspect. Next effect is Scale Assist. Here you got X and Y axis. You can scale or shrink the shape of the object by scale options.
Now for next effect, I have this type of shape. The name of the effect is spin. You can adjust the rotation per minute to spin the object. Next effect is stretch axis. Here you can stretch your object in any axis. Now for next effect, I will make this type of stick shape and then place it behind circle. Now I will set the pivot point to the uppermost corner. Now pair the circle with this stick. Now I will add the effect called swing onto the stick. Now you got this type of swinging animation. So these are all the effect in move and transform effects of a light motion.